We're going to look at how to import images into a PowerPoint from AutoCAD and we'll do that by a number of methods including copying and pasting, copying and pasting a picture, inserting a JPEG or a PNG, exporting and importing a BMP, doing a print screen, doing a print preview and a print screen, and also taking a PDF and doing a print screen. Let's start with perhaps the most familiar method and that is uh, copying and pasting. I'll go to my my AutoCAD drawing here and I can copy and paste by simply clicking and dragging along the portion that I want to select and then right clicking and I'll go to clipboard copy I'll go back into my PowerPoint and I'll right click and I'll choose paste notice it includes the black background there Another option with copy and paste is copy and paste a picture. And I'll just right click again and there's the paste that I did last time. Here's uh, copy and paste with a picture. And I'll resize these later. Uh, the next option that we have here is to insert a JPEG or a PNG. And again we can do that this from AutoCAD. Uh, in this case, using the print or plot dialog box, I can scroll down to the bottom under printers and select either a PNG or a JPEG. I'm going to select a JPEG here. It then allows us to choose a default size based on the pixels. The more pixels, the bigger the image, the higher the quality. I'm going to use my window option because I'm familiar with it and it gives me more control. I'll place my window over the portion that I would like to print out. I can center the plot and preview it. And if it looks good, I can plot it. Now you want to save it to some location. I'll put this in a new folder called Final Project and it's going to save this folder as a JPEG and then when I go back into my PowerPoint I can insert that JPEG image which is a picture image by clicking on the insert picture uh, file icon here. I'll browse to the location that I saved that file and okay and I, I missed the location there's the JPEG so I can select that JPEG and then I can insert it and it places it in in there. We'll uh, do a little resizing later. Next option is to export and import a BMP or a bitmap file. Uh, BMPs are the highest quality and you can probably tell by looking at these two that that image is, is a higher quality. It's the highest quality image you can get. It also takes up more file size. To export and import a BMP file you can go uh, back to AutoCAD and I can export from the menu browser by clicking on it and choosing export and then other formats and I can select BMP from this drop down here I want to choose the location to save it I'm going to put it in my final project folder I'll say save and then I get a selection box asking me to select the object so here I will I'll select um, select these objects here 
hit enter when I'm done. I'll go back into my PowerPoint. I'll uh, go to insert picture from a file again. Browse to that newly created bitmap file. I'll say insert and it places it in. Uh, next option. Looks similar because it has the black background but actually it's a print screen and you can tell by uh, noticing the grid that's visual uh, visibly visual in the background there. A print screen is one of the easiest ways. On your keyboard there's a button called print screen and it prints everything that's on your screen. So I'll go ahead and select that print screen button. It's usually up in the top right hand corner of your keyboard. I'll come back to my PowerPoint and then I'll just right click and say paste. And it pastes uh, everything on that screen. Now in my case I have a, a dual monitor so additional information comes, comes up there. Let's take a look at our, our next option which is the print preview and print screen. So this is similar to the last method except that in AutoCAD we we queue up or we prepare the image that we want to see uh, by using the plot dialog box. So I'll select a PDF, I'll, I'll choose a paper size, I'll just pretend I'm gonna print it like I normally would. I'll put a window around it. Um, I'll center the plot and I'll preview it. And then from the preview I'll size it the size that I want. I'll hit print screen. I'll come back to my PowerPoint and again I'll just I'll just paste that that image in and then I'll I'll resize it later. A uh, final option here is a PDF to print screen. And uh, what I'll do in this case is I'll open an existing PDF file such as this one here that we created previously. I'll get it in the orientation that I want so I'll rotate it counterclockwise. Um, I'll kind of maximize the size of this uh, this image on my screen and then I'll hit print screen I'll come back to my PowerPoint and again I'll just right click and paste this image in and then I'll resize it later so those are our different techniques for importing AutoCAD images into PowerPoint.